Well, hey, brothers and sisters, it's Brother Matt back with another message from the Lord for you. Uh, this message I'm going to read today is from October 27th, 2023, uh, from just earlier this morning. Um, if you're new to this channel, please do look at the other videos and see the other things that the Lord has been giving me to declare. Um, he started speaking to me around Easter, uh, at Easter, and over a period of about 50 days, the Lord visited me and gave me a message almost every night. And then since then, uh, he has come when he has come. And so uh, what I've been doing on this channel is just to read the message that the Lord gave me uh, exactly as he gave it to me without a lot of explanation or comment or, any, or anything else added to it, but to just let it be uh, what it is and to speak it and declare it the way that he gave it to me. So please do check out the other messages, the other videos, so you can hear the other things that the Lord has spoken, because from message to message, sometimes there are some different things and some different, um, you know, things that the Lord wants to reveal and say through these things. So check them out. For those of you who are subscribed, I'm grateful for all of you and for the community that's begun to grow up around this channel. Please do like this video. Please do comment on this video. Um, if you have prayer requests, please put your prayer requests into the comments so that I can pray, so that other people here can pray for you. And please do share this video with other people that you think uh, need to hear it, um, because I think that that's really what this is. This is the Lord's message that he wants to have declared. And so I'm doing my part, and, and if the Lord is leading you uh, to share it with others, then I, I hope that you will do that. So having said all of those things, I am going to read to you now uh, the message that the Lord gave me this morning, October 27th, 2023. And this is what it says. I, the Lord, the maker of heaven and earth, the God of your fathers and mothers, the God of Abraham and Isaac and Jacob, the Most High God, the King above all kings and Lord above all lords, he who is the avenger of blood, he who is the lamb that was slain, the anointed one of Israel, the only hope for man, the peacemaker, Jesus, the Messiah, the Nazarene, he who was born of the virgin, he who was prophesied of old, he who was and who is and who is soon to come. I will speak, heed my word, O oh, you wise. The armies of the north move to encircle my people, Israel, an alliance of nations sets their face against me and against my chosen and anointed ones. The armies of the Lord rise up to meet them, for there is war in the heavenlies even now. The powers rage. They boldly set their faces against me and against my people. The forces of this spiritual darkness set feet to action and move the hands of nations. However, I will not leave my people undefended. The prince of my people rises up to defend them. This struggle is not merely between flesh and blood. It is fought in the heavenlies also. Do not be fooled by what you see with your eyes. There is a hand behind the hand. The adversary believes that his hour has finally come. He moves to devour deception, accusation, despair, doubt are the tools he employs against you. 
He is the father of lies, for he is the liar of old. But the lie cannot stand the light of my truth. I am the way, the truth, and the life. I am the light for your path, the light unto men by which they may be saved. The lie cannot stand in the light. Though the darkness would contend against me as if to devour, the light will devour all darkness. See the times for what they are, O man, and know the hour soon approaches. Prepare yourselves for my coming, for I am coming soon with the shout of the archangel at the sound of the last trumpet. Heaven will break forth. The veil will be removed from your eyes. The sky will be rolled back as a scroll. On that day, you will see. For the unseen will be made visible. All that is hidden will come into view. You will see things as they are. Oh, for the terror of that day when all will be laid bare. No man shall hide on that day, the great and mighty day of the Lord. Yet do not fear, O my children, you who are the sheep of my pasture, for to you it will be a day unlike any other, a long-awaited day, the day of victory. I have told you these things, that you might warn those who have ears to hear and eyes to see, that they would ready themselves for me, that they would turn their eyes from earthly things and set their eyes on me. Listen, O man, and heed my words, for my day quickly approaches. Repent and return. Seek me while I yet may be found. I, the Lord, have spoken. Believe on me and be saved. That is the message that the Lord gave me for October 27th, 2023. I pray that the Lord would reveal to you how you should respond to it. Uh, as always, brothers and sisters, I'm grateful for all of you. And uh, I will see you next time.